that after all these years, God has given me the opportunity to be one of the persons to decorate my younger sister. I must digress a little bit, though it's uh, this thing. Uh, Sarah has been a younger sister and a pillar to our family. Not only my own, but the whole Jimeta family and the Ehindero family. We run for her, those that are her elders, for advice. The younger ones run to her for also advice and also when they do something, they don't want her to, to know. <laughs> she is a disciplinarian. We are very proud of you. And we are happy that you have gone this far. Other senior officers that have been promoted, I also congratulate you and wish you all the best and pray that this is only the stepping stone to higher rank. As it is said, promotion comes with responsibilities. It is saying that yes, you have worked hard, but it is now time for you to work harder. So we are all looking forward to seeing that you have you will work very hard, harder than you have worked before, so that you will justify the confidence that the Nigeria police have on you to have promoted you in the first instance. We on this side, we will support you in whatever means we are to see that, yes, we've excelled to exalt the position, to see that, yes, you really deserved that rank. We will stand by you to see that you succeed. All of us also will have to join hands to see that the Nigeria police itself succeeds. Very soon, we are all aware that campaigns have already started for the next general election. It calls on all of us, all police officers, all ranks from head to toe to be very, very professional in whatever we do. We are going to be challenged in all spheres. We are going to meet a lot of challenges with, the polit with politicians, with political parties, with different interest gr uh, groups, and also with ourselves. So we have to make sure that we... Promotion comments not from any man, but from God. And we are grateful to all those who engineered our promotion. I'm sure my colleagues here those that when promotion comes, it comes with higher responsibility. Now, you have now grown and become a level, another level of management. So a lot of responsibility is expected from us. Our daddy here has told us a lot of things that should be expected of us, especially with the general election that is coming. Sir, we on this side promise that we will do our utmost best in the performance of our duty to do it professionally and also to do it in line with professional standards because that is what the police is after.
my fellow promoters, officers and men of the Zone 5 headquarters. Well, first of all, I want to be grateful to God Almighty who have given us this opportunity. I want to equally thank the Inspector General of Police for doing us well and for this honor and done to us. We call it grateful to our AIG and the Commission on Police and the State Command. We will promise the organization that we put in our best. We have been doing it and will continue to do it. We will not relent in our effort. It's an assurance from us and all the newly promoters. God has been elected, have been elevated to the rank of Assistant Commissioner of Police. We thank God for that. They say, once you are promoted, it's more work. We are going to add more work to make sure that the crime situation in the two states is going to be reduced to the barest minimum. We have the laws to work with, the electoral laws and the Constitution of the Federal Republic. And we also should know that the whole community is watching us. We have gotten accolades in the recent by-elections that have happened, and other elections that have happened in other in these states. So we should make sure that we remain professional and disciplined in whatever we do. We must be completely independent. The present police administration, heavily headed by our available uh, Inspector General of Police, IGP al Kali Baba, who has just been given the national honors, that he has been trying to see that, yes, police excel. He cannot do it alone. We have to be with him. We have to key in to all the policies that will make the police great. Here in Zone 5, we are doing our best, and we assure the Inspector General of Police and all Nigerians that we will remain professional, neutral, and thoroughly disciplined in whatever we are going to do to ensure the success of not only the general elections that is coming, but the success of democracy as it is. Finally, let me pray that for the promoted officers, God will give you the ability, the health, the wisdom, and the courage to carry on with the ranks you have been given. We also pray that for all of us and for Nigeria and for the Nigeria police, that God will give us the courage to remain neutral and professional. God will also give us the ability to withstand the challenges. And God will give us the ability to deal with all the security issues that are facing this country.